My dear brothers and sisters, the word of encouragement for you today is to never lose hope. And I know that in this time of this pandemic that we all are facing, we all have a tendency at some time or another to be discouraged because of the many difficult circumstances that we face each and every day with the shutdown of the economy, the loss of so many lives of our family and friends and, and relatives. But God wants us to stay focused, keep our eyes on the prize. And what is the prize? The prize is Jesus Christ himself. He wants us to remain strong and be courageous. Walk in faith. And when you open up your Bibles to Jeremiah 29 and 11, the Bible clearly teaches us that there is hope. God says to us in that very clear passage of scripture when he tells us clearly that he has a plan for us. In other words, God knows the direction that he is sending us in. For those who have accepted him as our Lord and Savior and who is willing to learn to lean, trust, and depend upon him. He says, I know the plans and those plans does not include plans to harm you or hurt you in any way or make you fearful of what you are facing because the many trials and tribulations that are out there, all of us at some point are going to face them. He says, but I do not have in mind any plans to harm you. But what I do have is that I have hope for you. But you have to be able to learn how to lean, trust, and depend upon me. He says, I will never lead you astray. All you have to do is follow me. But of course I give you free will and you have a choice. You can either follow me in the directions that, that I am taking you in and the plans that I have already laid out for you or you can follow Satan because I have hope and a future already clearly laid out for you and so I don't want you to walk around today tomorrow or any other day in fear of what might happen but stay focused upon what you can do to keep yourself away from harm and keep yourself from being caught up in this virus because it is spreading all over the world uh, each and every day in greater abundance. I want you to learn how to use your common sense so that you can be safe and you can keep your family safe. Don't lose hope. Just maintain your focus. And finally, in the book of Deuteronomy, Deuteronomy 31 and 8, here's what the Lord says in his closing. He says, It is the Lord, it is your God, who goes before you making a straight path that you may be able to walk daily 
in faith without losing hope. He will be with you. He will not leave you or forsake you. Do not fear or become dismayed because the Lord your God is going before you. That's Deuteronomy 31 and 8. So my brothers and sisters, the word of encouragement for you today, never lose hope. Amen. Thank you for watching the videos on our channel. If you would like to see more great videos of what we have to offer, just click on the subscribe button. You could find it over there or perhaps over there or even down there. Do it now. Subscribe today.